Morning, everybody. It's 8 a.m. Saturday morning. It rained like crazy last night. It woke me up. It was raining so hard. Uh, no thunder or lightning, just pouring down rain. Yard's pretty wet right now. Uh, let me show you. You can see it's it's pretty wet, and the mud is, or the dirt is muddy. We're going to go ahead, and uh, it's, it's, it's sprinkling right now. Not hard enough to really do anything, but I'm going to go ahead and break a shovel out and do a little digging, uh, hoping the ground is soft. It's probably going to be muddier than heck. I, I don't know how well this will work, but i got to get on top of this because I've only got a few hours before i got to get ready for the soccer game. So um, I'm going to start over here on this side of the house, dig as much as I can. I'll show you where I get before I take off to the game. I've been digging for just a little over two hours, right at two hours and 15 minutes. And let me show you what I've got. I'm, I'm pretty happy. The ground was softer than I expected. Thank goodness for the rain. But let me show you what I got. I put my holes in the trench on trickle so that I could make sure I had the right slope. And as you can see, the water is moving downhill quite nicely. Uh, I think when I put a pipe in there, uh, it's going to actually have the right slope to it. Let's get all the way down to the bottom here. And you can see the water's all ending up at the bottom, which eventually there will be a pipe down here that I will tap into that will run all the way down there to those rocks right in front of the street. And there's a big drain there that it's going to go into. So I'm really happy. Uh, I think what I'm going to do now is go ahead and get the pipe, uh, get it laid in the trench, and uh, start thinking about burying it. Whew. Time to start gluing up the pipe. I'll start off by putting an elbow up there where the drain is, just below the surface. And I've got my pipe laid out all the way down, so all we got to do is glue it up and bury it. I've got my pipe all glued up. All I need to do is roll it into the ditch. Back in the back here, though, I've got a couple pieces of pipe here, and this one here is long enough to extend this just past that mark. But truthfully, I need to be careful. I don't want to underextend or overextend. I mean, I've got to I've got to make sure I line up with the ditch. So I think what I'm going to do is leave it here like this, leave it trenched out. I'll build the back of this hole up with some mud so that it digs here and goes that way. And uh, it'll, it'll kind of dig it out for me a little bit. And that way when I lay the big piece of pipe in there, I'll have a nice big hole that I can use to attach everything up. So I'm just going to roll the pipe into the hole and start burying it. That looks good. And I've got a great lineup with my gutter, so all I need to do is buy an extension piece and drop it straight down into the adapter that I'll put on here in a few minutes. Well, the first run's done. Uh, I used 45 feet of pipe. Let me go ahead and show you what it looks like. I'm going to stop on the way back from the soccer game and get a piece of extension gutter pipe so I can run that down into the ground. And of course, I have an adapter for gutter pipe for that. You can see I did the best job I could mashing this down all the way down to the end. It was kind of tough because the ground is so wet and it just keeps clumping up. I mean, as fast as you mash it, it clumps back up. What I've done at the end here is I don't plan to wait too long to do this, but I went ahead, I just left the pipe open and I just dumped a little mud in there to kind of slow things down. Um, and I built this mud dam so that the water can come down, it can swirl around here and go on out the ditch. I left it open like this because I don't exactly know where my large pipe is going to be positioned and I want it to leave leave it open so it's easy to connect to and adapt up. I didn't want to I didn't want to have to bury it and redig it up. So now that that's done, uh, I'm about a half hour before I need to start getting ready for the game. So I'm putting the tools away. I'm calling it quits. I'm going to take a shower, have a sandwich, cool off and enjoy some soccer. We'll be back this afternoon if the rain holds off to uh, dig the second one. I'm very happy. I did not think I would get this far today. Thanks for hanging out with me. I'll see you soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.